Spam, spam, spam. Anyone who has an email account knows what it is, but they prefer not to. Unwanted email is among the things that annoy people most of all. Piles of junk sometimes hide messages you've been waiting for. According to the latest statistics, on average, 30 spam messages arrive every day in a computer. It usually takes 30 seconds to read and to delete each one. As a result, 15 minutes of work time is wasted. One user, Vladimir, got sick and tired of the daily cleaning of his email box and decided to take action. He demanded compensation for time spent on cleaning out the spam. Getting hundreds of promotional emails every morning was the last straw. It was discovered this businessman was behind the unwelcome distribution and taken to court. The judge ruled he should pay a 5,000 ruble fine. It's the first time in Russia fighting spam has dropped into the frame box of the law. However, both officials and users are uncertain the case would set a precedent. Spammers are, as a rule, serious people with huge opportunities and a lot of money is required for equipment. So whatever I do, any filter I set in my email account, it won't help. The funny thing is, spammers get their own spam too. What can be even more worrying is how the spam is sent. Using a virus, spammers can infect computers and turn them into zombie PCs, stealing thousands of emails without the user's knowledge. It's hard to believe that the word that makes an office clock funny these days used to feed most of Europe some 50 years ago. Spam was the name of a canned product. Some said it was rather tasteless. And though spam in this case is not to the user's taste, the obstructive delivery continues. Now you guys, Rush today, Moscow.